Cue the music. It's me, Gary, and Nick. We're here with our pre-Christmas show, one of our pre-Christmas shows. we got another week, I think. Come on, let's look at the new book. Show. Look at this. Holy crap. Thrasher suit. How about yeah. that? It's another one of the ones where, yeah, it does kind of, the head's kind of small for, it just, it's, it's supposed weird. to be, though, isn't it? Because he's going to be... But then you put the helmet on and, who run Barter Town? <laughs> Master Blaster. Seventh Sword. Sometimes you got to choke somebody. Uh, we're missing something. Unless you're in the NFL. Okay. Afterlife with Archie. What cover is that? That's the Popoy. That's the Popoy. But here is the Frank Avia cover. Oh. Look at that. That's good stuff. Oh, uh, we got Alice Cooper. Amazing Spider Man. We're still going. Here's Constantine. You like Constantine? Everybody that watches the TV show. The, yeah. Apparently Copper, watch. It's supposed to be very good. A lot of people like it. Excellent. It's getting more steam. Crossed. Crossed. Some stuff going on there. Brian's pick of the week, Deadpool's Art of War. Here comes the Hulk, by the way. Uh, let's see what else we got. Uh, Grim Fairy Tales. Goddess, uh, or Goddess Goddess of the Galaxy. Guardians of the Galaxy, Goddess. You, you know, see why you, you avoided that one? Look at the cover of the Grim. It's not one of their typical ones. Yeah, right. Yeah. There's, no... There's not enough cleavage on there to yeah, catch right. your attention. Uh, we will. We do like to mention. Speaking of cleavage, Harley Quinn holiday special. Oh, yeah. and then you got two covers to choose from in there in you the do? stack. There's a Christmas one too. Oh. Both Amanda Connor's awesomeness. Well, hello. We got a new couple that come in, and she they've gravitated towards Amanda Connor's art, sure. and I'm like, well, you're in luck because there isn't a nicer person in the industry to talk to at a show. Yeah, she's awesome. Um, actually, both of them are Jimmy Dugdale oh, yeah. and Amanda Connor. Haunted Horror. Harold, Lovecraft, and Tesla. You got science, and you've got Cthulhu. What do you need? What it's, else do you need? It's a buddy comedy. Buddy yeah. cop comedy. October Faction, Steve Niles, and Damian Worm. A couple covers on that. Parallel Man, I don't know what that is. Anyway. It's absurd, there's an absurd amount of creativity in just one issue. And who knows better than Ain't It Cool News. The, the, Peter the, Panzerfaust. Peter Panzerfaust. Haven't been able to say that in a while. I know. Planet Gigantic. Hmm. Uh, let's see what else. Southern Dog. Fourth issue of Southern Dog. Yeah, right next to it, that empty spot is Southern Bastard. Yeah, Southern Bastards we sold out, but it's in. Because Southern Bastards is awesome. Remember what I said about 18 years ago? Southern Bastards. Yeah. Southern Bastards. Southern Bastards. How long like, did we have to wait for X-Con, too? Yeah, right. Same thing. Southern Dog. Fourth issue. Redneck Werewolves. What else do you need to know? I'll tell you some more. Riley Ross Smoke Covers. I that always one. helps. Yeah. Uh, Spider Man and the X Men won. What? That takes over for Wolverine and the X Men. Uh, Spider Verse team up. A little more, more of this Spider Gwen action. Spider Gwen, SpongeBob comes. What? SpongeBob is one thing someone pointed out to me. I didn't realize. Since I guess he killed her, Jerry Conway is writing the Spider Gwen story. Nice. Yeah. Jerry Conway, another nice guy you yeah. can talk to at a convention. Um. I get the feeling some of the older guys, though, when you tell them how much their stories meant to them, they're like, what story? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, they're just like, it's something I did like 30 years ago. I wrote like a comic book. Uncanny X-Men Annual. Uh, Jeff Lemire, Matt Kent, Paolo Rivera, and Joe Rivera on a little bit of Valiant issue. Probably the first time in a while. I mean, we've some more numbers on the, on the Valiant stuff going out, which is always good to see. Probably thanks to the freebies that Valiant sent. Yeah. Yeah, we like Valiant. Um, the Walking Dead. Never heard of it. No. Is that Beth? Is that Beth? I don't know. No, that's called filler. Yeah. Uh, Wild's End. Dan Abnett. Another one of the many animal... Red Hood and the Outlaws, as we know. That's the name that I've chosen from... Yes, my... we know. Yeah. Uh, Marvel Sil Silver Age Collectibles. A guide to the Marvel Silver Age Collectibles. A lot of fun stuff in there, so check that out if you can. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man Annual. Amazing X-Men. 
which is, you know, a lot of these are crossing over with Axis, so. Uh, Avengers. Avengers. Here's what irritates me about the Avengers. The last page of the last issue was awesome for Shang-Chi fans, and then in this issue, the next issue, Shang-Chi's not in it. I leafed through it. Uh, just one of the ones, couple you jumped over. Just, oh. just hit them. Astro City, Angry Birds, Angry Birds Transformers. Sure. Deep State. Look at that. Deep State issue two. How do you feel about this when it happens? When there's a dread book. Uh, that's the second issue of the movie, second movie sequel story. Yeah. Uh, Dungeons and Dragons book, Legends of Baldur's, Baldur's Gate. Baldur's Gate. All, all you old school gamers know yeah. that one. New Eternal. one from Boom. Looks pretty interesting. Yeah. Got that. Hero Cat, by the way. Uh, Itty Bitty Bunnies, Rainbow Pixie, Candyland, Cockfight. I'm Are so you... glad I picked, I did not skip that over. Yeah, right? We wow. got that, we got a book where we get to say bitch, and, and we got Cockknocker. <laughs> Itty Bitty Mask, Zoot Suit Riot. Zoot Way to make sh fun of a tragic event <laughs> yeah, right. in Los Angeles history, yeah, but right. yeah. Speaking of tragic events, look at that. Big white ape. That's yeah, that's, I, yeah, that's what I was looking at. Um, Prometheus, Fire and Stone. A lot of people like that book. Oh, Paul Tobin. Yeah. You write to... Pick of the week. Punisher. Punisher. Punisher is good. Punks, Punks. the comic. Joshua Hale Fialkov. Drink. Uh, Especially if you're reading that. Yeah. Fist Head is that guy's name. I'm just guessing. I have no idea. Oh, it's still better than Fist, though. <laughs> or Cockmonk. Rachel Rising. That's a great book. Regular show. Yeah, keep you regular. It's like Bran. Sure. Bill's pick of the week. Squarriors. It's about warrior squirrels. I think Bill does copious amounts of LSD when he's. A lot of people fun. bringing that one up just because the, the just the cover alone. They're like I, they couldn't they're not murderous squirrels. Yeah. Hey, Tooth and Claw did good. So there's an idea whose time has come. Made out of mud. Star Trek. New Visions? Is that one of the photo things? Yeah. Photo book. Look. Look at that. Photo novel. I guess is what you call it. Supreme Blue Rose. Suicide Squad. Got a new team in there. Lots of interesting Suicide Squad. Uh, you know, or am I thinking Secret Six? No, no Suicide, Suicide Squad. Squad. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Um, anyway, a lot of interesting casting news about the Suicide Squad. As a Joker fan, I approve. I approve. Winter World, although I would like to see Crispin Glover play the Joker once. That'd be good. Dennis's pick of the week. And by the way, Dennis is back to work and uh, putting barbecue sauce on everybody's comics just like the old days. There so, you go. Earth 2 World's End. Uh, X. I like X because it's written by Dwayne Torsinski. And it's super violent. It's super violent. It's very grind housey. Yeah. You look like you're getting ready to turn it off. You pause. No. Oh, okay. X Force. I thought maybe you uh, had to poop or something in the middle of. The nah, I, I I'm pretty regular. I go in the morning. Axis. Look at that. Axis. We got a lot of copies of Axis. Avengers World. I like Avengers World, especially when they have like weird teams of D-listers, Stingray and 3D Man and U.S. Agent and. Yeah. yeah oh, I like and that. don't forget back there that. Ooh, finally, nice. the last trade volume of the Nightwing oh, series. Nightwing, yeah. Axis Carnage. Uh, bad, bad girl. Yeah. Why does she look like Beyonce? What's going on? I don't. I have no I clue. I don't get that. Batman Eternal. X Con by Dwayne Swazinski. Love that book. FBP. Nick loves that book. Um, Flash Gordon. Classic. Classic Flash Gordon in Hawkman uh, armor. Yeah. Fraggle Rock. Future's in no care. Clarion. Futures. She's so. got some crazy hair. She's got the crazy eyes. Yeah, that's the one you walk away from. That's the one you walk away from at the bar. Right. This is the one you walk towards yeah. at the bar. It don't matter if she's got horns and red skin. Doesn't matter. Nope. Little Nemo. Lola. Well, I like this cover. That's cool. I don't know. What do I know? I don't know nothing. What do you know? Rocket Raccoon. That's good stuff. Oh, look at this. Hey, there's two of our favorite customers. What? Mark and Tiffany. We'll be right back. 
Hey, we're back. We uh, had some customers, so we had to uh, stop the video. And they were yip, yip, yip. They were yip yappy. Anyway, um, Rocket Raccoon, Scotty Young. Got that going on. We got uh, Samurai Jack. Finally got some on the shelf this time. How about that? And the 200th smash issue, 100 page super spectacular of Savage Dragon. 200 issues that book's gone. That's that's one of Image. I don't read that's the book, the, but good for them. Yeah, that's images. That's one of Image's first titles. That's good for the whole comic book industry. Oh, yeah. My pick of the week: Sex Criminals. You are what you read. Bagged for mature readers. Duh. Duh. Except I'm very immature. Well, yeah. Everybody knows that. Sherwood. <laughs> Sherwood. See what I said? See what I mean? Uh, teen dog. It's like, he's a dog and he's a teen. Sure. Uh, Thor. Tower Chronicles, nice Simon Bisley cover it looks like. Yeah, yeah Matt Wagner story. Yeah. Uh, Transformers, all new Ultimates. It's just working its way to the end there on the yeah. Ultimates. X-Men, Zombie Tramp, I thought I'd show that to it's you. No, you know, it's an ongoing now. I thought it was just going to be a mini. Thank God, now oh, we'll I finally know. get some answers. I know. Yeah. Um, we got a bunch of WWE Pops. Is it WWE or WWE? Yeah. yeah, okay. WWE Pops. We got Undertaker, Macho Man Randy Savage. Yeah. This guy who looks like he was shipwrecked somewhere. Um, Hulk Hogan, Triple H, and then we got some Magic the Gathering pops. Yeah. Gideon Jura, Tezzeret, Elspeth Terrell. And what? then two more over there. Yeah, and then and we then got uh, Kiora Atua. I'm making these names up as I go. I know. Nicole Bolas, look at that. That's badass. That's just a cool dragon. Yeah, sure. All right, so what else we got here? We got, oh, look, there's Two Face. That's a nice look. At all the Batman the animated series. Uh, the figures for that are pretty awesome. And there's right. Batman. We got more Batman's yeah. in. There's a, we knew with Two Face is a Mister Freeze. Oh yeah, that's right. We'll show you that in a second. My Little Pony hardcover. French Adventures and Friendship. That's Nick and I have a little journal that we write in that yep. says that. Ghosted trade paperback. If you're not reading Ghosted, that's one of my favorite books. It's right now. It's a good book. Yeah, it's so awesome. Uh, new number one. From uh, Kelly Sue DeConnick, Bitch Planet, Girl Gangs, Caged and Enraged. That's Caged Heat, Jerry. Yeah. Helheim. Brides of Helheim. Brides of Helheim, pardon me. Butterfly. Great Phil Notto. Ooh. Art. Cave Woman. Cave. That's just. That's good old know. fashioned yeah. uh, exploitation. Uh, Coffin Hill. Is that a Dave Johnson cover? All of them are. They're all always awesome. Uh, George Perez's Sirens. George Perez, not a nicer man you'll ever meet. He's right up there with Daryl Banks as far as I nicest mean, people in the comic book he is. Empire of the Dead, that's a cool cover. Is that Alex Malief? Looks mm -hmm. like it. No, I guess not. He, he did the interiors on the last miniseries. God is Dead is in the bag also. A little hang dangle. Ooh. Ooh. This is in a bag, bag too. God Killer from the, Black Mask. There was something in there that I didn't know what it was. So I just oh, we're opening this. Time <laughs> after we're done. I had to cover myself. We on like the Black Mask comic, so you should buy them. Except for Critical Hit. Yeah, the it's one about the animal rights thing. The Goon: Occasion of Revenge, Part Four of Four. That's just my personal opinion. I shouldn't say you shouldn't buy it. That's Mercy Sparks. You like Mercy Sparks? So I do. Sure. Here's uh, Patricia Briggs. <laughs> Mercy Thompson. We got a couple Everybody fans of Patricia Briggs here at uh, Bill's Books. My Little Pony. There's Nightcrawler. I like Nightcrawler, but it's apparently not going to last too much longer. Synergy. I don't know what's going on there. That's From the co-creators of Powers. It's Mike Wave on Omen and his... Uh, Taki Selma. It's his wife. It's his wife. Skylanders. Skylanders comic was hot for about, what, 35 seconds? I think so. Yeah. Solar, Man of the Atom. I honestly don't think that the Skylander people know there's a comic out there. I don't think so either. Hey, Skylander people, there's a comic out here. Yeah, go buy it. Solitary. Got that Another one from the Devil's Due. Yep. Carl's special pick of the week, Sonic the Hedgehog. Looks like a holiday th issue. Awesome. Awesome. So that's the new comics for the week. Let's go see what else we got. We've shown you some of the swag. Let me, I'm going to show our image display. Oh, yeah, Again, they, right. they restocked us, obviously, with some bitch planet number one i just like saying that <laughs> did you see how you leaned on bitch the bitch <laughs> part of it uh drifter these are number one second prints and they they really want people to start getting in the shutter this is actually a really cool book so issue seven so and then of course we still got tooth and claw oh i'm sorry autumn lands autumn Since, lands has changed yeah image didn't we also remember. got these little tote bags with rocket raccoon on one side bang star lord on the other i'll throw that right on the floor <laughs> I, I don't know. care you don't care i don't care and then there's these little 
Yeah, mad, we, mad vinyls. Spy versus spy. Spy versus it? spy. So it's always awesome. And then we got some more swag up here. There's actually all kinds of, who's that Mr. Freeze we were telling you about from Batman the Animated Series. This uh, line of figures is very representative of one of the best iterations of Batman uh, ever. Bruce Tim Art. You How don't you go wrong. wrong. Look at these little things. Game of Thrones and Batman. Everyone likes mini pops. How about that? We got a, another Deadpool uh, wacky wobbler. I'm sure we've had that in before. Uh, Holiday Kiss Superman and Wonder Woman statue. Yeah, that's the mini They're under statue. the camel toe, mistletoe. <laughs> um, we've also got this. It's a uh, San Diego Comic Con exclusive Green Lantern figure pack. The three and three quarters, yeah. Look, it's Dexstar. Everyone buys stuff for Dexstar. Sure. And then we've got Flash and Vibe back. We've got a Michonne bank. Here's the rest of her sword. She's not broken. Yeah. She's, I mean, maybe emotionally, but... Um, another uh, Comic-Con exclusive, the New York Comic-Con exclusive Poison Ivy PVC figure, limited to 2500 We've got one here in the store, kids. We've also got this, Super Best Friends Forever. The three-pack. The three-pack. Those are pretty awesome. And this sweet, sweet, sweet Iron Man figure. The Heartbreaker Armor. The Heartbreaker from, from Armor. From Hot Toys. Yeah, so we got that. And we've got the Cock Knocker. Cock knocker. Look at his fist, man. He's vascular. That dude is vascular. Oh, yeah. Now, there was actually two more statues over here. Oh, yeah. There's the, the Aquaman. And Flash. Flash and the is Flash. Doing, Flash is doing pretty well for himself lately. Oh, yeah. And uh, is this new? I think we just reordered. Yeah, we ordered reordered the Rocketeer. The cock knocker got... The knocked. cock knocker got crazy. So let's see if we got anything else over here. We got uh, an angry Stay Puff Marshmallow Man pop. And we've got the, more of the wrestlers. And the minions and Magic the Gathering, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, All that cetera. good stuff. Yeah. So, uh, oh, we got one more thing. Bill picked this up. Uh, picked it up at a show a while ago, and it's just been sitting back here, and we don't know what's, what's going to happen with it. it. It's vintage uh, Joker fun darts. Apparently, twenty-five Five. points to take it in the mouth. <laughs> That's all you got to know. Twenty-five. It's worth twenty-five. Twenty-five in the, in the mouth. Yeah, twenty-five in the mouth. I don't know what. If you like the forehead, what about if you hit in the eye? I don't, the uh, eye that's gotta be more, that's gotta be 50. But okay, we're done being juvenile. Well, we're not, but we're done with the video anyway. We got anything else we want to No, say? okay, so uh, we will see you soon. Um, come to Bill's Books and buy all kinds of Christmas presents for your nerdy friends. Until then, stay nerdy, my friends. Toodles, buddy, buddy, buddy. No, I can't do it. <laughs>